Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. So this will be the part 21 of my video series on family GPS tracker using Android Studio. Okay guys, in our previous video, uh, I showed you how to upload the user image to the Firebase uh, storage. Okay, and uh, then we also uh, updated the image URL of the user image from the Firebase storage to the real time database. <laughs> okay guys so I, I did not show you the output so in this video I am going to show you the output of our pro, uh, of our app so that you may know that what we have done so far okay so now let's run my app okay and if I click okay let's see okay so now I have connected my phone Alright guys, so now we have this uh, app. Let me show you the database values. Okay, so now I deleted the users. Okay, and also our uh, database is empty. Let me show you. Okay, it's empty. Alright, and if I click on storage, uh, it's also empty. Okay, so now if I click on sign up, let's create an account. And if I say Harun Faisal and Outlook dot com all right and if i click on next it's checking whether this account already exists or not okay and let me set the password one two three four five six seven let's click on next here i need to write my name on and i need to upload an image and let's say i have this image All right, let me crop that and let me click on crop. All right, so now the image is set to our image view and now we need to click on next. Okay, so now we have this unique user um, circle code 649460. All right, and here you can say, uh, you can see save this uh, invite code, your friends will need it to join your circle. Okay, so now you need to click on register. Okay, so now here you can say, see, please wait while we are creating an account for you. All right, so in the meanwhile, the user authentication will be done and uh, the values will be uploaded to the real time database and also the image will be stored here in Firebase storage. Okay, so now uh, here the map is opened. Where is our location? Okay, so there is our location. Okay. So now let me show you the uh, the values here. Uh, we need to refresh that, and if we refresh it, you can see the image file. Okay, so now here we will have a folder. Okay, user images, and if I click user images, here you can see the image which we just uploaded. Okay, so now if we click on that image. Uh, that image information is shown here and the image will be shown here okay so now if i click on and you can see this is the unique user id f l i okay and if i click on database here we will have this uh these values okay and you can see in our image url we have this image url okay and if i click on authentication you can see we have this user all right so let's try to uh, let's try to create another account so that you will know okay, if i click on sign up and here i can say i need to enter my gmail account and if i click on next one two three four five six seven and i click on next okay my name is hamda and i click on that image and so I need to let's say crop and now you need to just click on next here we will have another unique uh, circle code and we need to click on register and here you can see we have the okay so now the user is registered so now if I click uh, if I refresh 
and you can see another user and with our database part we have got another user also the values here you can see okay to these two and also we need to see in our storage folder and now here we will have this uh, user images in folder and in our, this folder we will have two images now okay and this one is the image which we have just uploaded all right guys so if you like the video please like it and subscribe goodbye